come to her house for the past on time. Shaky hand knocked on that door. Butterflies and pickup lines were all that was on my mind. We drove past that black man's store. Down as we rode up to that 20 mile river bank. Not a city light in the sky, but we could see alright. It's you I have to thank. Mississippi moon shine down on me. Like the way to love. So my heart can see that the night burns so. I'm now, now I don't care, just a Mississippi moonshine. Fireflies were dancing to George straight on the radio, and she looked so good in love that I just. the close as those twilight hours pass by hiding from that sun yeah we were ready to run cause it just all fell right shine down on me like the way to love so my heart down on me like the way to love so my heart can see that the night burn what is up everybody welcome back to lumberjacks dynasty yeah we're doing pallet delivery today with our brand new truck the lorry we bought last time toward the end i guess is when we bought it uh, getting a pallet delivery done today. I've also got 30 pallets waiting and we need to chop some trees because uh, we're out of we're out of materials waiting um, We do have some bark we can deliver, but I'm not gonna bother uh, Yeah, we don't we don't have a whole lot of materials waiting behind so we're gonna get all that done today. Hopefully uh, We'll get well, we'll get something done today I'm not gonna say we're gonna get everything done today, but as you can see if I could find it there we go uh, 30 pallets waiting to create now we have uh, 32 pallets drying over there. They're not going to be done for quite some time. So we're going to deliver these, make some money, and uh, make a few dollars anyway. It's not going to be, it's not like it's a huge payday because we've only got six, but we'll have something. Uh, Spiderette, how's it going? Gargle, what's up, buddy? How are you? Uh, I'm trying to find my cruise button. I can't, I can't, I, I don't have the map, buttons mapped the same between Farmer's Dynasty and Lumberjack's Dynasty, so I got to remember which buttons what every time I swap. <coughs> Today is Bob's birthday. Happy birthday, Bob. Um, Gargoyle, how are you, man? Spider Edge, Slafer, Battery, uh, Marshall, how's it going? Hope you're well. Pace, what's up, bud? How are you, man? Hope you're doing well today. Gabriel, how's it going? Uh, I think Corrine's in here. I saw a minute ago. How's everybody doing today? Hope you guys are well today. Uh, just, just messing around with some Lone Jacks Dynasty. Gonna be delivering some pallets first and foremost, uh, that way. Uh, you can't say it's clickbait in the title because it's not. I delivered some right at the beginning. Um, and then we will probably... Why am I drifting to the left? I feel like, I feel like my A key is... Maybe it's just because the road was curving to the right. That's probably all it was. Um, where was I going with that thought? I had a thought process there somewhere. 
Uh, anyway, uh, we're gonna deliver some pallets first and foremost, so you can't say it's a clickbait title because it's not. There we are. Delivering pallets. Just like the title in the thumbnail says. Uh, sell 1560. That's not bad for six pallets that would just... I mean, otherwise it would just be wasted. Really. So, not bad. Not bad. Uh, how much money did that say we had? 12,000? Oh, that's right. We used social points, didn't we? Yeah, we did. Uh, so, just as a reminder to you guys, if you're not checking the giveaway channel uh, in Discord, do so. There is a copy of... Uh, the Final Station, which is, uh, it looks like a really good game. I almost, I almost bought it and did a series on it myself. Um, you can check it out on Steam. Uh, Brian dropped the link in there for it. Uh, and the game that nobody needs a link to because you all know what it is, Barn Finders, there is a copy of that uh, up for the next four days or so, four and a half days, whatever it is. Um, get on that giveaway. It will end on uh, Friday or Saturday. I think it's Friday night sometime, I guess. I don't know. Um... But yeah, make sure you're checking the giveaway channel in Discord, uh, and then we will be doing uh, some other random game stuff at some point in the giveaway channel as well. So, You want lumber? You got lumber. Absolutely. Yeah. What's up, Mike? How's it going, man? Hope you're doing well. Sell them pallets? You talking about sell the, the pallets of planks we got down here? Should I? Bone, what's up, man? How are you? Welcome back, Karain. Do I sell these pallets? These got fixed, right? So these these actually cost money now, correct? I mean, these don't cost money. They actually... Uh, you don't get the full amount for them, is that right? You get a better, better price if they're dried. I think that's how that works. Oh boy. A little tighter turn than I thought it was there. Sell everything including your vehicles? Why? Why would I sell everything? I don't want to sell it all. Thank you, Crane, for dropping the uh, shout outs for Mike, Bone, and Gargoyle there. Much appreciated. Why would I sell it all, though? I don't want to sell all of it. I want to keep my vehicles. I just bought this one. I just got this truck, man. Sell the pallet truck. There you go. That'll make some money. <coughs> yeah. Yeah. We don't want to be a lumberjack anymore. We want to hunt aliens. I mean, to be fair, uh, Barn Finders is a lot of fun. And I cannot wait to get to the next one, because in the next one, I think I'm going to get past where we uh, did the demo. So, the next one should be a lot more fun, I do believe. But you can run everywhere, that's true, yeah. I can run faster than I can drive there, that's for sure. Hundred eighty euros. Nope. We'll keep it. We'll keep it for hundred and eighty. That's not worth it. That's not worth it. I'll keep it and dry them out. So they definitely fixed that part of the game. Uh definitely fixed that part of the game. What's up, Ethan? How's it going? Mr. Spets, how are you? Hope you're doing well. Two halls and you got enough wood for thirty four uh plank pallets. Really? Wow. That's a big trailer, then. Uh, I wish they would have put an attachment on the back of this to be able to pull a trailer around with. But, you know, you can't always get what you want. What's up, Brandon? How's it going? Am I going to buy more land to cut down trees? I will, yeah. I've still got to clear some trees off of the land I've got next to me here. So... Yeah, I've still got a few trees to cut down uh, on the land uh, I've already gotten, so uh, I guess we can do that. I guess we can... I don't want to sell these for, for half price, because that's basically what this is, right? 180 is is uh, half price. You get 360 out of these normally, if I'm not, if I'm not mistaken, which I'm, I normally am. 
Let's just be honest about it. Normally I am wrong about that, so. Uh, and I think I just want to take these and set them off right here. There we go. We'll just pull the truck over here. And we'll go chop some trees because we need more we need more lumber. Oh. Took out part of the barn there. Sweet. Go chop some trees. Sleep the needed time. You, just, you guys want me to just skip days? You just want me to skip time instead of cutting trees down? I feel like there's so much more we can be doing though. I mean, maybe not right now, but uh, there there is other stuff tomorrow when we sleep. There'll be other stuff to do. Oh God! See this, this tabbing out thing. I just went to scroll and it scrolled like everything in my Streamlabs and my chat and everything. There we go. You get a log stuck in the trailer, use the old trailer to remove stuck logs. Okay, so basically, um, just because you get the new one does not mean that you need to get rid of the old one. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, we'll do them. We'll keep the old one, for sure. What's up, Joe? How's it going? Uh, you are not that late. You are only about uh, six minutes behind there. You're actually in pretty good shape. Oh man, we need to eat. Oh, it didn't. I didn't let it finish, I guess. <coughs> You're eating a little lunch? Yeah, I'm going to eat lunch when I get done streaming. Uh, I thought about eating beforehand, and I was like, man, I'll just wait till after. Um, and the boom arm pull pallets out of the dryer. Yes. Uh, I, as far as I'm aware, it can. Yeah, I, di I did that the first time, I think. I grabbed some out of there. I don't think I can put pallets in the dryer, though. Uh, but it can do both, yeah. It can do the chipboards and everything. I don't think I have enough energy to uh, actually pick those up, so we may have to just pull down beside this here, which not a big deal. Uh, I want to start on the other end, though, so we're going to go around. We go around this side. There's a, a stump right in the way, of course. Uh, but I want to start with this big in here. See if this actually works. Oh yeah, we're good. We're good. Okay. Start with the big boy. Got us a nice base. That'll work. We'll build off of that. Yeah, I should be able to stack a whole tree on here. I mean, that's... It'd just be silly if I couldn't, right? I thought that was a bigger tree than that, though. It definitely felt like it. Did I miss something somewhere? I don't guess so. All right, let's go and load these. No sense in just piling it up as more than more than needed uh, on a trailer. Uh, one tree at a time. One tree at a time. It's fine with me. Been waiting to catch another deuce live stream. What's up, crazy? How's it going? Don't drive over the logs with the trailer. Yeah, I try to avoid that at all costs. But good to know that they do. They will glitch out and get stuck. That kind of thing. So, yeah. He he gargles warning, guys. If you're playing the game and you don't know some of these, then then definitely definitely heed the warning.
What have you missed? You haven't watched the last couple episodes? Well, I'm not going to update you. You need to go watch them. I mean, basically, d d doing some side missions and some funny gags and stuff. I mean, it's, you know, it, it, the same thing you miss in everything else when you don't watch it. Things. Yeah, but I got a pallet truck, so that's good. That's the major thing, I guess. What's up, Dylan? How's it going? I don't know if this is actually part of the path or the road. It doesn't seem like it would be, but we'll take it. The pallet truck doesn't load logs, though. The pallet truck loads pallets. Uh, I gotta buy the upgraded trailer to load logs. But we'll get there. We'll get there. Yep, battery, that's dead on. <laughs> that's dead on right there. Alright, let's just leave that guy there, and we'll try to drop this one this way. Hopefully, drop that way. Gabriel, the next one I did after that had 20, 2700 or something. So yeah, I know the feeling. I definitely know the feeling. Um, the the first grass cut mission had 700. The next one had 2700 or something. So uh, ridiculous. Yeah, there's so much grass. What's up, Stiggs? How's it going? Hope you're doing well today. Good, good. Um, Brandon, I don't think there is. Honestly, I don't think there is. If you find them, though, you do let me know. I would be curious to meet this person. Also, uh, the way that it reads, my motherboard should be here um, tom uh, Thursday. Should be here Thursday, so this weekend I'm going to be rebuilding the office. And uh, we're going to be doing a computer build after the office is rebuilt. So um, it should be, should be a, good, a good week next week. Should be a real good week next week. Uh, if... If all the computer components work properly together, it should be a good week. Let me rephrase. Uh, it could be a very bad week. I don't know yet. <laughs> After we get everything together, we'll know for sure. But uh, either way, we'll have a new computer build next week. So, Which I am pretty excited about. I'm ready to run games at 60 FPS while I'm streaming. You want at least 10 camera views? Well, I mean, it's going to be on my phone. I, that I, my computer is going to be down because I'm going to be rebuilding it. So uh, my laptop will not stream. I've tried it before. I wish it would. It just won't do it. Yeah, I'm going to be streaming it on my phone though. So uh, meaning it'll be crappy, but I'm still going to be streaming it. So.
Concentration level 1000. Well, I mean, I'm I'm using the same hard drives. You, you do know that. The, the hard drives is where Windows is stored. So, I'm not going to be reinstalling Windows. And we reinstall a lot of drivers. A lot. Um, I'm not doing a complete wipe. I'm, I'm literally just putting in a new motherboard processor RAM video card. Like I've, done, I've done all this before and had, didn't have to do a complete reinstall. If I do, then you can forget all the progress we've made on any game. Uh, which you might do that anyway, because I don't... Steam doesn't like moving save files for some reason. So when I move Steam over to my other two hard drives, I might lose all my progress in all my games. We'll see. Uh, if so, we're going to be restarting Farmer's Dynasty and Lumberjack's Dynasty and anything else I've got a save file on that doesn't want to move over. No man's land. Gonna be interesting. Definitely gonna be interesting. Let me go see what that was. That didn't sound like good things. Give me just a second. Hey, kid's making a smoothie. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't know what it was, and uh, our Greyhound, he's got a, a place on his foot. He's been hobbling around the house the last day or so, so Miss Deuce is going to have to get a, uh, uh, a vet appointment made for him to go see what's going on with it. Um, but yeah, I didn't know. It, it sounded like he was sliding across the floor. That was what I heard from back here, so, uh, you know. I was like, well... Let me go check and make sure he's not sliding around in there with his bad foot. So, uh, turns out, nope, just a kid with a uh, with a blender. It's fine. Yep, yep, absolutely okay. Um, to be fair, it's one of those bullet things where you like you put everything in and then you turn it upside down and you push down on it, and it blends everything together. So it's not one that you can like shove your hand in. It doesn't work that way. <laughs> That's probably a good thing, to be quite honest. Probably a good thing. All right, let me uh, stop here. I want to get one more one more load in today before the before it gets too dark. Where'd my there it is? So where'd my tree go? I had a tree here a minute ago. Gotta drop it right there. Uh, have a question. I don't have enough to get both. Should I get Farm Sim 19 DLC or Barn Finders? I mean, are there mods out there that you could do with on? on farm sim 19 for a while bob that kind of do the same thing i mean if, why is this tree going way over here like what that is not the direction i cut come on man uh if there's mods that'll do the same thing as the uh keverland dlc then i would think i would go with a different game altogether bob you know what i mean like that that's just my thinking on it because there are mods out there for farm sim that will kind of do the same thing so uh, yeah but but bones right too though barn finders is kind of a one-time playthrough thing you know so i mean that take that in consideration as well it is a one-time one-time playthrough for barn finders you're not going to get some replayability out of it i don't think
I, I would I would think I would think probably go with if if you want a game that has a storyline and you're and you're just enjoying it and all that kind of stuff, then the Barn Finders, of course. And I mean you you know that there might be mods out there for you know that are similar to the Never the Keverland DLC that might be worth it. But also you know that you might not get the same uh, experience out of those as you do from the DLC, right? So I I, I would go I would go with the the DLC um, if you weren't looking for a storyline game, right? If you're looking for something that's got the storyline and all that, then yeah, go for it. These logs are massive. They don't look like it when they're sitting on the ground, but when you drop them on your trailer, then they just do this. That's a massive, massive log there. How much is the bigger trailer? I might go buy that with some social points. Oh, I can't pull the big trailer with this tractor though, can I? Or can I? I don't, I don't know that I can. All right, a few more logs to add to our stack over there. Uh, I really wish the size of the log actually gave you more or less planks. That would be a lot to code, but. Go for the DLC, try to win the Steam Key for Barn Finders from the giveaway. I mean, that that's not a bad idea. Uh, I'm probably gonna be doing a copy of the uh, Keverlin DLC as well. I forgot it came out yesterday. Or today, to be quite honest, I, I, I really slipped my mind. Uh, I would have been doing a video this morning. I just didn't think about it. I got on Twitter and I saw it and I was like, oh, the DLC came out today. Um, but yeah, I'll probably do a giveaway of that too, so. Made around 62k to buy the bigger tractor and the log trailer. Yeah, that's about right. Okay. Uh, not to be out of left field, but... Why is it when you wash your car, it either rains, or in my case, bird in a 50 mile radius come to poop on it? Yeah, that, that seems about right, Mr. Spitz. That seems the way it is, too. We wash it, it rains, our birds land on some invisible wire above it if you don't have anything for them to land on and poop on it. <laughs> every time, every single time. All right, we got lots of, lot, lots of logs going in over there. Uh, there's still some waiting to be pushed in, so. And that's using social points for both? Ah, oh, crap. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, guys, get used to this trailer for a while. <laughs> We're going to be in this one for quite some time. All right, let's head over to the house and uh, go to bed. It is quite late. Our sleep is getting pretty low as well. Well, not, not super low. Look at that bird right there waiting to poop on something. I see you. Uh, I think we've probably already done our honey check for the day, right? I feel like we would have. As it is pretty late in the afternoon. Uh, we can go double check, but I think we would have already done this by now. Oh, we didn't. Oh, look out. Okay. Around we go. Just spin them this time around. Yeah, you know I'm gonna be you know I'm gonna be starting over anyway. I said I wasn't going to be pushing for a million social points this time. Well, I may, I may have. I may have, uh, I may have lied. <laughs> Just flat out lied to you on that one. Um, I'm probably not going to push for a million social points. And I actually may give them a million social point dream on Farmer's Dynasty as well. Because that, 
That's a lot, guys. That's a, I would have to do a lot of playing. Um, and, and just being realistic, I just don't have time to play four or five times a week for several hours a day on Farmer's Dynasty when I have so many other games that I'm doing. So uh, I'm just going to play and enjoy Farmer's Dynasty and try to get Timmy and then try to get Timmy into school. And if, and if we end up with a million social points, that's fine too. So glad I don't have a vehicle worth washing. Me too, Tiny. What's up, man? <laughs> What's up, Tank? How are you, man? How you been? Gamer Dad, what's up, man? How are you? Does Timmy get out of bed? He does eventually. Yeah, Tank. Uh, he eventually, he'll be in school. So, um, uh, on my first season, we did. We actually got Timmy out of bed, but um, on the second season so far, we haven't gotten a Timmy yet at all. So, herbal potions. Uh. What am I missing for this? Oh, I can only make one. That's why. Okay. Let's see. Where's my little slider bar? I can only make one, though. Yeah, Mike, I think we chose the wrong one, dude. Because I, I I'm having the same issue. I can't get a Timmy. Uh, going good. Going good. Thank you guys for asking. I appreciate you. Um, yeah, going pretty good for me. What is, uh, do I not use either one of these for these? Boxy or Picatilla? Oh, no, I do. I use it for this. Okay. Uh, I just need more Bullis. Bullis? Bullis? Is that what it is? I don't, I don't know how to pronounce it. <clears throat> Eat some apple jam in the morning. Nothing wrong with that. Down we go. I'm actually hungry. Typically, I'm not hungry when I stream, but even if I don't eat breakfast or anything, I'm typically not like typically not this hungry. I need to eat. I'm definitely gonna be eating me a sandwich after I get done streaming, though. Well, we have just about cut all the trees on this property. I've got a few more, which we're going to try to get done today. Uh, how many can you drop in before it tells you you can't drop them in anymore? I don't really know. And how many can I have back? How many pallets can I have backed up uh, in the lumber mill over there? Does anybody have any idea? <coughs> ah, crap. You got four hours of work left. That's a good deal. That is definitely a good thing. It can you can back up a lot in there. So thirty to sixty, it's not too concerning, I guess. Is that rain? This is the first time it's rained in game, guys. Weird. For me anyway. Still told you she was pregnant and boom out comes a kid. Wow, okay. Never showed. At least 101. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> 999 pallets. Wow, okay. At least 300 chipboard. Well, we don't have to worry about it until we can just stockpile for a while then. Um. Since it's going to be winter on the FSN soon, I may jump on here and do some grinding and just cut down some trees. Uh, but I'll definitely make sure that I show you guys um, if we buy land or not. And we're probably about to look and see uh, what land we can buy. Because I want to start looking for another piece of property because this one is almost cleaned out. I've got four trees, five trees left. So I want to start looking for another piece of property pretty quick.
Tractor's fun to drive in the rain. Does the rain actually affect the, the steering and all that? I mean, does it actually like have trouble pulling and slide around? Oh, look at that. Look how good the, the rain looks. It actually got kind of cloudy. This looks really good. I like it. Then I like it a lot better when, when it'll actually process and I can get, you know, 45, 50 frames a second while I'm streaming. That'd be nice. You grab the plot across the river? Okay. We'll check it out. There's a heist going? Heck yeah. Oh, that's a big tree. We're not going to be able to get anywhere near all of that one. Come on. There we go. Work with me now. Work with me. Plot across the street, eh? Oh, I missed some limbs back. I was going to say, why, why can't I cut it now? I'm holding up traffic and everything. Yeah, so after the, uh, the 21st is when the final station ends, guys. The giveaway for the final station. Uh, after it ends, uh, I will be switching bots, so I'll be getting rid of that bot that, that's running that giveaway, because it didn't do a, like a timer countdown, it just says ends on. So, um, after we get through that one, I'll definitely be, uh, using a different, using the giveaway bot that's running the, uh, Barn Finders key. Uh, so you can see the countdown, see how much time is left on it, and all that kind of stuff. Uh, there's a lot of stuff I'm trying to switch around and trying to work on on the back end. Just to just to help out and make things easier and make things a little easier to find. Stuff like that. So, um, And of course, as always, if the community has any ideas on anything that I need to be doing differently, you guys can let me know. Let me know down in the comments. Let me know in live chat. I'll be more than happy to, to take a look at it and take it into consideration. Even if I don't do it, I will still uh, take it into consideration. So... Do I hold it down or do I have it on toggle? I hold it down. Yeah, I'm probably weird, Bob. I, I hold it down. Um, I, I don't know why. I just I feel like the toggle, I would leave it on all the time. You know what I mean? Like, I, would, I mean, you guys know this, too. I would forget. I would forget the stupid thing was on. And I'd just be walking around. Everybody would be going, turn it off. Turn it off. <laughs> and you guys know that's the truth. I did not think that was actually, I was actually going to be able to get that. That is, uh, okay. Cool. Uh, we'll just carry this guy back over then. Dude, it's really coming down now. Look at all the rain. He bought the little plot across the street from the store and they got the big one right behind it. So this one and this one. I mean, there's a, there's a lot of woods right there, it looks like. And Bob, you bought one of these. I mean, that's not a that's not a far drive there's a lot of it looks like there's a lot of forest there too forest area is 0 0.7 uh, 0 0.47 this is 0 0.05 it really depends on how much they are I guess that's that's the that's the major thing I've only got 12,005 so it's gonna depend on how much they cost can drive across the river right there can you really no 
No, we're going to have to check this out. Bob's about to make me drown my tractor, I think. So, you're talking about right here you can drive across. I just, I don't see it, but we're going to give it a shot, Bob. And if I sink the tractor, it's all your fault. We're going to save before we do. Hey, Bob's freaking out now. He's like, no, don't drive across there. <laughs> There's a bridge. Yeah, right over there. Is that it right over there? Yeah. Yeah, yeah the little bridge. Yeah. Yeah, I just wanted to mess with Bob Green. <laughs> <laughs> I just wanted to mess with Bob. Oh man. Bob's ever going, no, don't drive across that. Yeah, I thought there I thought I remember being a, there being a bridge over there. Hey, looks like Bone Mike and Corrine came out on top that time. Heck yeah. I knew there was a land bridge or a bridge or something over there somewhere. Yeah, I just wanted to mess with Bob, see what he'd say. You can drive across the river right there. Oh, can I, Bob? All right, let's, let's go. <laughs> so rigged. Every time, Bob. Every time. All right. Man, I really like the rain. Uh, does it rain inside, though? It does not. I know it doesn't rain inside the house or inside the, the greenhouse or anything, but these little sheds like this, a lot of times it gets overlooked, so I wanted to see. I wanted to see. Like you can at Oregon Trail? I doubt it. Um, I just don't think that would work. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and go over here and see how much this cost. Uh, I still have four trees to cut down. But we need to be prepping for some new land here, too, so. wonder if you go fast enough the Doombug can get across the water. We will find out, Bone, as soon as I buy one. I promise you that. I will definitely find out. Yeah, so this is probably a lot closer than the other side, right? Well, I don't know, man. Like, if I buy this piece of land, which that one's a big piece. I don't know if I can afford that. Uh, I don't know if I can afford either one of these, to be quite honest, but we're about to find out. This is 12,500 and I've got, uh, or it's 12,900. I've got 12,500. Yeah. So I could buy it for sure. Uh, if we can sell a couple of more pallets, I can, I can definitely buy it, but I should have some more, um, what are those things called? Uh, the press board, the, the, uh, chipboard. I should have some more chipboard pallets pretty soon. So make another thousand and yeah, I'm gonna buy that one. That one's, that's pretty nice. There's a lot of trees there, Bob. Good call. Good call. Yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be able to afford the other one. It's almost double that size. So. When does painting come out? I have no idea. Uh, as soon as as soon as I uh, I know or am able to tell people, if if I get told, um, normally I know when you guys know. So I know when the public information hits. So as soon as I know something about the painting and all that kind of stuff, James, I will definitely let everybody know, man. Uh, I like keeping people up to date. Where am I going? I got to cut these trees down. See, what I don't understand, oh, I guess because my uncle owns the land, not us. We can't cut those down, and I don't know why. Like, other than because we don't own the property and uncle does. There's a road map. Oh, there is, yeah. There is a road map. I guess I could go look. I just I just choose not to, Bob, if you want the truth. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm stubborn, and you guys all know it. I 
I gotta, I gotta cancel that cut. I was gonna fall right on top of the pin over there. I was looking at it, I was going, that's gonna fall right on top of that thing. Yeah, cut through, right on through. It's still gonna fall on it, isn't it? It's gonna hop around for a minute first. Sweet, there we go. Not for me, for James. Well, I mean, I feel like I need to be looking at it too, Bob. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Like, I get I get all the information you guys get, and I don't even use it. Like, if there's a roadmap, I could go look at it. I don't mind answering the questions. I just, I haven't looked at the roadmap, and I really don't know. It's going to be sweet being able to play this game with more than 8 FPS. In some situations. The tree limbs is what causes the lag for me. There's not optimized. Like the tree cut down thing, the trees being cut and laying on the ground is not optimized yet, which is 100% understandable. Again, you don't want to go through and optimize a game every every update. That's just a lot. So uh, typically there'll be several updates in a row and then you'll get a small optimization. So we're going to clear off this plot today? Yes, we definitely are. Uh, because we need to deliver more pallets. I figure by the time we get done cutting these down, um, there will be, oh man, there's a lot of tree here. Uh, there will be enough pallets to deliver again. We'll have at least six or seven, so. Um, I kind of want to cut down one more. Come on, fall on the ground. There we go. I don't want to cut that one down too. Not that I can hold all these. I don't think I don't think that's possible with this little trailer. But if it was possible, I'd like to. What's up, Hugh? How's it going, man? Hope you're doing well. Where's my stack at? There it is. I had a stack of trees laying around there somewhere. There is a stack of lumber. I think that's the last one right there. We just push it. No. Pushing it is not going to work. <laughs> you only half read in game stuff. I know you're not going to read all the roadmaps. Right, Bob? At least, at least you guys know this, right? You guys know this coming into a stream. Unless it says update news or going over update or something in the description of the game. I mean, in the description of the video. You guys know I'm not going to read everything. It's just not not possible. I mean, it's possible. I'm just not going to do it. I mean, in all reality, I should be. But, well, I mean, let's, you know. I should have a lot of stuff done before the stream starts. I just, I don't. Wow, that's actually a quote, because it's true. That's not a good spot for that. Let's try it again. Uh, still worked out about the same. Okay. Gotta get all the big ones first. Stay. Aha! Got it. Okay. Cool. Uh, I'm kind of making myself a side for the trailer here. Perfect. This is not how this works in real life. But I'm not a lumberjack in real life, so it doesn't matter. Sweet. Made ourselves a, a side out of the tree. All right, now I think I can actually get the small one on here now. Maybe. Small one is still going to have a couple of big logs. Or at least one big log anyway.
You should trim this field with the volume on max today. No. No. Just no. Absolutely no. That is definitely not going to happen. Uh, I'm just going to be happy to get some logs. Um... I'm happy to just get some logs over to the thing, much less clear off an entire plot. This will be my first plot that we cleared. And I'm pretty excited. And I just can't hide it. Uh, I think it's just three. I think we can probably just reach them. No need to stack them here. Nah, we got this. Oh god, we started moving too soon. Uh, okay, maybe it's locked down now. I started moving too quick. My fault. And honestly, this may be a case of, uh, there's just no more room to put anything on there. I mean, look how ridiculous that looks. That's a stump. Go around the stump. Right, three more trees and two more trees. Two more trees and we're going across the river. After we sell some pallets. You gotta love the invisible straps, I'm telling you. I'm doing good, Hugh. I appreciate you asking. Appreciate you asking. Uh, so, Indy was nice enough to fert my field last night in Farm Sim 19. So, you guys know that we did the harvest and then... Uh, Replanted and fertilized and all that kind of stuff yesterday. So, um, Indy was nice enough to do the refert last night because he was he was on. So, he was like, "I don't mind. I'll be on for a while." And I was like, "Man, if you if you did it, that'd be awesome because I'm probably not going to be up late enough to actually get it done." So, uh, I appreciate him doing that. He has no idea how much I appreciate it. it saved me some work today, uh, but now for my farm sim network stuff. I don't have anything going on until, uh, like, summer one. We're going to do some tree cutting this winter, though, I'm pretty sure. Uh oh I think I may have uh, made a mistake there, guys. I think the mistake is getting bigger. Will those actually break loose at some point? I just keep dropping logs here? Okay, seems that way. Yeah, maybe I need to uh, go out a little bit. Or go back a little bit, rather. That could have been bad. I could have just been stacking logs up right there the whole time. Can I actually get this one? Yes. Okay, good. Don't forget to like the stream, everybody. Mike is right. Thank you, Crane, for the like reminder. And Mike as well. Guys, remember to hit that like button on the screen there, just below the video somewhere. Uh, if you are enjoying the video, you can subscribe, hit the notification bell, come back and watch more with us. Uh, you can also head on over to Twitch and, uh, and follow there uh, if you would like to, because I do stream on Twitch. Uh, tonight is our subsistence multiplayer night. Yesterday, directly after the YouTube stream, I jumped over on Twitch and uh, did some FarmSim 19 uh, multiplayer action on the FarmSim network. Uh, it's always good. It's a lot of fun. I'm having a blast with it. Honestly, I love. I just love how how I can get deeper into the the FarmSim world. Uh, with that and it's it's just a lot of fun it really is I'm just having a lot of fun with it um, but yeah until uh, until summer one I don't have a whole lot going on on farm sim network so I'll probably be doing some tree cutting and such uh, wood chip stored 700 kilograms how many are waiting only have three waiting okay so we gotta oh whoa easy easy turn slower deuce turn slower we have a long way to go here we've got 44 of those waiting so we got we got we got some stuff we can we can keep cutting we're good. And they're totally okay with it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, the haggling is not on their end; it's on my end, and I love it. I love it. It's the American way. That's right. <laughs> That's absolutely right. Why did the tractor sell medicine? Because it was a farm assist. You get it? You get it? Nice one, Bone.
Whoa, that was my toes there, fella. This thing almost took me out. That was so bad, it was great. That's the point, Bob. <laughs> That's the point. They're so terrible, they're actually funny. Uh, what's up, Taz? How's it going, man? Hope you're doing well today, bud. Come for the sim games and I'll stay for Bones' dad jokes? Absolutely. Alright, I don't mind carrying them, but sometimes it's easier so I don't get these out of order when I'm putting them down. Just to go through like this and do it. Because I end up grabbing logs that don't need to go in there next. always have to wait because if I if I just go with it then I'll end up with a trailer sticking out the back I mean uh, a trailer sticking out the back a log sticking out the back of the trailer all right do we do I think I can get that next one I think I can stack both these on here I mean, to be fair, that trailer, look at the size difference. I mean, that really is a much larger trailer. You can put this whole trailer of logs on that one and then still stack logs on it. That is a much bigger trailer. Thanks, Unc, for, uh, you know, telling me I can buy your stuff and then not letting me use your tractor. Which, to be honest, I don't think I would want to, because it just kind of ruins the... It ruins the... Um, you know, building your own kind of thing. You know? Off it goes. But yeah, I don't, I don't know if I would want to, to be able to start with Uncle's equipment, you know? I wish he'd have sold his equipment altogether. I think that would have made it even better. That we don't even have the option for it. That would have been kind of neat. I think that would have been very neat, actually. That trailer? Yeah, that trailer's an absolute monster, yeah. Uh, the, the log truck, I cannot wait for. Imagine doing this with the Scorpion King. It's going to be amazing. Fifty-three on the new trailer. Wow, dude, that's impressive. Uh, Dylan, if you're asking if you can attach it to the old tractor, no, you cannot. Sadly, so we have to wait to buy the new tractor as well. So the new tractor is probably the first thing we'll buy to get the most expense out of the way. Or, um, if the, if the log truck comes along, I'll just buy that thing. Like, that eliminates having to have the tractor at all. Which I will buy the tractor at some point, but. I don't know how much that log truck is, though. There is a log truck, right? I, I'm not imagining that. The smaller, like the lorry log truck. I'm not making that up, right? It exists? Okay, cool. Yeah, I just, I thought I was, for a minute I was like, am I making, I had to sit here and think about it too. I was like, I think I'm making that up. I don't know if the lorry log truck actually exists. It's just not available in game yet. Yeah, okay. I knew there was something like that somewhere. This has a trigger point, I just gotta find it again.
Man, I don't want to drop it way up there. That's gonna be, oh god. This is gonna be difficult now, guys. Let's see if we can build our wall again. Don't move. Don't move. Okay, good. Totally, totally accurate. Um, invisible walls now. Uh, there we go. Trailer is just sliding everywhere. It, it likes none of this. I think it's sinking in the ground. Which, I mean, to be fair, the amount of weight on it, it really should be sinking in the ground. And there's actually space there for a log. Let me let me drop it right there. Yeah, I don't think this guy. I don't think this is happening. We're gonna have to come back and get the rest of those. I'm gonna have to come back and get four little old logs, guys. But that is the entire area cleared out. That is that is my property done. Uh, first area cleaned out. Makes me happy. Can you buy game money? What do you mean, Dylan? I don't. Th I don't think I understand the question. To be real honest. Save. Oh yes, good point. Save. Game save. How dare you clear cut that land? Well, we'll replant as soon as it's available. As soon as I can replant, I will definitely replant. I'm not a huge fan of cutting down trees, so. Own the game. Yeah, if you're talking about being able to spend real money to buy in-game money, no, and, and no game should. Honestly. Yeah, no game should. Like, that, that, that defeats the purpose of playing the game, to be quite honest. Like, I understand DLC and whatnot, but being able to purchase in-game money just seems like... I mean, it's it's just a waste of money. It's a waste of in uh, real-life money. Given people have their freedoms, you can do what you want to. Um, but for me, it always it always puts the... the um, it's always going to put people with money ahead of you. And that's that's a detriment, honestly. I just I don't see the point in it. That's just my opinion. Yeah, exactly, Gabriel. It just ruins the game. Yeah, what's up, Derek? How's it going, man? Hope you're doing well today. Have four little logs left here. Brain dropping the shout out for Mike Gargoyle. Peanut. Did you get Bone in there? Bone's Twitch channel in there? Claw didn't open up that time. It was weird. Did I get them all? Did I miss one? I feel like I missed one. Do I have four? One, two, three. I thought there was four. I feel like I missed one somewhere here. I guess not. I guess it was only three. Yeah. I guess it was only three. All right. We're done with this land. Oh god. Haven't seen anything on planting, just regrowth. Oh, okay, well cool. I mean either way, if, if something if something happens, it happens. You know what I mean? Like if as long as as long as we get some trees back, I'm fine with it. The 
game the hunter makes you pay money for in-game money yeah see that just that just ruins a game for me man i hate microtransactions like that if you're buying stuff that's cosmetic that doesn't improve your ability in the game at all then that's one thing but games that you can buy like in-game money that just it just defeats the whole purpose for me there's no point in playing it i mean i could literally just go buy the buy the best stuff and then it's like okay well now what do i work toward nothing because i have everything you know Chavez, what's up, man? Just saying hi. Uh, what you doing? Getting your bite to eat on break or something? Yeah, for exactly that reason, Derek, what you just did. Karain just shouted everybody out, and then you turned around and did it right behind her. That's the reason it's mod only now. Not necessarily because of you, just because it was happening. Um, it, it just got to the point where it was like, okay, I can't read what's going on in chat because there's so many commands going on. So, uh, yeah, it wasn't necessarily because of you, Derek. It was just because it was happening a lot. And it was like, one person did it, and then the other person did it too. And it all got spammed at one time. And it was like, okay, I can't keep up with chat anymore. So, yeah, not because of any one individual, just because it was hard to keep up with chat. So, don't you wish you could make furniture? I do, yeah. Yeah, I, I hope that becomes a thing at some point. That's going to be amazing if it happens. Um, all right, let's go see how many... Can I actually cut this? Am I going to get penalized? Oh, I can't even cut this, can I? Oh, no, don't cut that down. I'm liable to get penalized for that. I mean, to be fair, though... Can we cut this after we own the property, maybe? After we buy it from Uncle? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I just I didn't want anybody to feel like it was because of one person or the other. It was just generally because it was hard for me to keep up with chat, really. Yeah, carpentry would be amazing, especially if they integrated the different woods. Yeah, that'd be awesome. Um, You know what? Let's... uh. Let's go run across the river over here. Can I go under this? No. We still got a lot of logs coming. Uh, which is not really a lot. Because I feel like what I can hold on that trailer, I can hold double at least on the other one, so... Uh, we are up to 50, 5,460 kilograms of uh, bark, though. We may need to run a load of bark. Because that trailer does not hold 5,600, I don't think. Does it? Furniture scheduled for September. Sweet! That's going to be amazing. So we are going to be able to make furniture. That's going to be fantastic, man. I am super excited. Yeah, I was like, man, there's a lot of... Oh, no, never mind. It's not a lot of logs. After thinking about it, I was like, yeah, no. Uh, I've been I've been playing so much farm sim, guys, I'm trying to do manual attach. There we go. And doing bark while it's raining is probably not the best idea. But, you know. Do it holds 11,000, so kind of like Farmer's Dynasty, then. Because the one you start with holds something like 4,000 or 4,200. Yeah. That makes sense. Gotta go. All right, Mike, have a good one, bud. Uh, guys, if you haven't, go subscribe to Mike here on YouTube. Help the man out. Drop him a like on a video when he is live or when he is... He streams on Twitch, too, right, Mike? He streams on Twitch, yeah. Recently bought a chainsaw uh, resistant clothes. They were really expensive, but at least they didn't cost an arm and a leg. Oh, my. That one's even better. That was fantastic, Bone. <laughs> It'd be good if they paid by the weight. Are you talking about the logs, Bob? I think that'd be a great idea. Yeah. Yeah, I think uh, paying by the weight would be awesome. Oh, I'm never getting this thing out of here. I just realized how big of a mistake that was. Hmm. The wood Hello chips there. are getting wet, I know. Welcome to my store. Uh, 
What are you selling? What are you selling? Ah, uh, bit of this, bit of that, you know. Some tools, some fishing equipment, some gadgets. Some food for fishermen, too. So, what do you have in your store? I didn't mean to click the first one, to be honest. Uh, other. I want to sell you things, sir. Sale. Sale. Sweet. Can I sell some of this? Uh, there's no real reason to, is there? It doesn't cost that much. Yeah. Yeah, no real reason to. We didn't do some more fishing. We ain't done a whole lot of fishing on this one yet. Normally in Farmer's Dynasty, we've done at least two days of fishing by now. Well, that thing is difficult. A little platter. Oh, from right here. Uh, I did not. Let's uh, let's hop out and give it a look here. So is it this one, right here? I think it's right here, right? Yeah, this little plot. There's a lot of trees here, Karine. Good gracious. Uh, it is only 2,500 euros, and it's right here, right up the road. Uh, and we can afford it. Wow. Okay. Uh, I feel like there's more trees here, but this is like, this is a lot of, this is a big bang for a little bit of, a little bit of buck. So, yeah. There's a lot here. Proud new owner. Proud new owner of a forest, guys. Getting a little hungry, I'm sure. I'm sure we are. been a hard day's work here. Oh, I can't eat while I'm on the tractor anymore. I forgot. Okay. Oh, that being the case, we'll just stop right in the middle of the road and grab ourselves a bite. What's up, Brian? How's it going, man? Got you a new phone. Nice. Yeah, that seems like a that seems like a big bang for your buck there on that property. There's a lot of a lot of trees there. I want to go around and do some repair jobs for folks too, because well, we need the money. We we need the money. We need the extra money for sure. Uh, I should have a lot of pallets and stuff to sell at some point, but not right at the moment. So. Had the other one that went swimming in the deuce pit. Oh no. Yeah, anytime you drop one in the toilet, it's time to get rid of it. Even if it doesn't work anymore, just get rid of it. I mean, even if it still works, sorry. Even if it still works, just get rid of it. Don't don't bother. 58% fuel. Maybe we need to talk about some talk about some gas prices here. I just like that the, the, the game is, is true to the sense that they use pretty much every piece of wood, right? They use the chips, they use the bark, um, the planks, like the whole nine yards. Everything gets used, and I think that's amazing. Nothing goes to waste. How much do we get? Oh, we're actually making some good money off of this. It was like $2,200, right? Does it pop up and tell you? I don't remember. No, it didn't. I should have kept up with how much I had before. I don't know how much I just made. How much do you make off a full trailer? Has anybody done the meta on that yet? I feel like somebody probably knows.
and you can sell just the logs too yeah see that's pretty neat yeah because you can you can uh turn off the that side of it right and just have it run through and just collect barks and logs Once there's a uh, furniture maker, there'll be two places to sell chipboard. Yeah, yeah, exactly. This, I mean, it opens the game up to way more stuff, and I hope they, I hope they use every bit of it. Hope they use every bit of opportunity they're given themselves and us uh, to really, to really push the game forward a little bit. That pretty much just bought my new plot of land. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Yeah, that one trailer of wood chips just bought my new plot of land. Uh, bark, not wood chips. Bark. Sorry. Oh, by the way, uh, so just in case anybody's wondering, you guys remember the uh, the package that Chavez sent us, the care package. Um, quick update on the beef jerky status. Uh, I'm about halfway through the bag of pepper pepper jerky. All of the hot and spicy is gone. All the sweet and spicy is gone. And one whole bag of the garlic is gone. Uh, Miss, Deuce, Miss Deuce and the kid didn't like the sweet and spicy and didn't like the hot and spicy. They don't eat hot things. So uh, I finished those off by myself. Uh, they've been working on the garlic. I've been leaving it for them. Uh, so yeah, it has been uh, it has been used. That is for sure. I see animals, so there's got to be. Yep, that's what I was hoping. Got to be herbs here. I don't. The mushrooms I'm not really hurting for, but uh, the herbs are nice. So uh, you got to do a little bit of everything. I know the title. I know what it says. I'm aware. Looks like there's the mayor and chief down there. But I've got to I've got to stop and pick these when I see them. For anybody that's not playing the game, this is ne this is a necessity. Like you have to do this. Uh, you don't have to, uh, but if you want to further yourself, make money, and have different options of making things, then you need to do this. Let me rephrase: you need to. If you want more variety, there's plenty of that. Making sure that was the only little area there. It was. It seems. Okay. Cool. Is that a mushroom? That is a mushroom. More on this side. I figured there was some more somewhere. Typically, you don't get one little section and, and that be it in the area. So, always try to walk around and find more. Maybe there'll be furniture quests. That'd be amazing. Yeah, that'd be amazing. Uh, I th again, I think anything they can they can think of to include with the furniture setup would be awesome. Um, because it would be a waste not to, you know what I mean? If it's already, if it's, there's already elements in the game, it'd be a waste not to put more, uh, with the furniture stuff in game because there's so much opportunity there. There's so many different things you can do with it. And if they end up not doing it, cool. You know what I mean? I understand coding and cost and all that kind of stuff, but, um, add, add, adding as many things with the furniture as possible would be amazing. I, I believe. You can run with the logs. Yeah, I need to. I need to work on the strength potion at some point. Um, I thought I saw a plant up there. I guess I didn't. I don't see any mushrooms or anything. So. You did the first logs you know about the switch, Bob. I think I did too, actually. I think I sold something. Uh, just, I think I sold some logs just to make some money right off the bat. Maybe I can't remember. Like a strange place for a street light. It really did, didn't it, Cloyd? Yeah. It really did. It was like, why is that there? Looks like they've all migrated. Yep, that is our property right yonder, I think, right? Yeah. Our little corner lot there. These guys have anything on my property here? Nope. None to be had. Okay. Fine, fine. Go back to our daily business here. Did I lose social points? I don't think so. Did I? I wasn't really paying attention, to be honest. Um, how did I lose social points there? I don't know how I lost social points. I'm not going to lie. 
Why was the mushroom farmer a good person? He had really good morals. Ah, nice one. All right. Detach from that. Pick up the log trailer again. Let's go check our progress here. We'll take a quick peek around. 55 planks waiting. I've got a bunch. Let's go check the dryer here. Oh, not me. Oh, okay. 40. Down to 40 on those. 51 on these. Uh, 53 here. 52. Oh, I started on this end. That's why. Okay. Yeah, 52 on this end. Uh, there are six waiting to create. There are 1,275 wood chips stored. So that's six. That'd be right. Uh, and there are zero logs. All the logs have been processed. So, uh, as quick as I can get them over here, probably the better, to be quite honest. Saw the new DLC for Farm Sim is out. It is out for sure, yeah. Uh, how many of these are waiting? 55. That's right. Yeah, it's definitely out, and, uh, I'm anxious to check out the new Baylor, honestly. I've, I've got the DLC, so, uh, I may be trying to record a video of that today. Uh, speaking of that, guys, uh, I am bringing my live streams back, um... It is it's it it saddens me to say that I will no longer be doing the simcast, but I have too many games going on and I'm I'm struggling to get everything in every week. So uh, for myself, uh, for the channel, um, and for the community, it was better for me to go back to doing content at the moment because I've got so many things going on. So tomorrow live stream will be Farmers Dynasty since I did Barn Finders on Monday. So, usual time, noon, noon 30, somewhere around there, central, uh, 1, 1 to 1.30 1 p.m. Eastern. Um, we'll be streaming on Wednesdays again back on YouTube. I just, I didn't want to make a big deal out of it because it's not a big deal. There was no hard feelings. There was no ill will, nothing. It's literally just... The amount of time that that I'm having um, to spend rearranging and leaving games out that I really want to put in, so that one day a week actually is making a huge difference uh, in the amount of content I can put out. So um, it it needed to happen, and just right now it just fits the schedule better. So yeah, no no ill will. There was nothing. Uh, nothing like that. It just, it basically just came down to scheduling. That's really all it came down to. Over you go. Yeah, this one doesn't have a lot of the big, big trees, but it's got a lot of trees. Um, five pine, 12 spruce, and four dead trunks. So the dead trunks are the really big ones, right? Or is it the spruce trees that are really big ones? I'm not sure. Hey, how you doing? Welcome to the outhouse. Socrates Santa, thank you for subscribing. Welcome. But yeah, I just before before anybody said anything and, and any any kind of rumor mill or anything. There was no ill will, no hard feelings whatsoever. I'm still a partner to Trotto. I just can't, uh, I can't continue with the schedule because my schedule changed. So when my schedule changed, it changed everything for timing. So um, that's basically all it boils down to. So I just didn't want anybody to think there was anything else going on. Literally, just came down to scheduling. Say, so that's that's pretty much it. I really do, Brandon. Yeah, I really do. I really need to start recording more videos to try to get them, to try to get everything else worked in as well. Uh, there, there are games I'm leaving out every week and only do it every like once a month or something. Um, Deadliest Catch is one of them, simply for the fact that, I mean, honestly, th there's without a second season and without Opelio Crab, which is all coming as far as I know. Uh, all that is coming in the future. Just without all that right now, it's hard for me to put together enough content for it to do videos on because I'd have to play for like three hours to get a 20 minute video because I would cut out all the extras, you know, and I mean, any, any good YouTuber would, you would cut out all the, all the time in between, you know, if you're setting pots and something funny happens, then that's cool. But if not, you cut it out, you know, 
and I think I think that's probably the the best option is to leave it as um, leave it as a live stream because I enjoy being able to hang out and talk while we're while we're doing the crabbing. But that also means that other games are going to take precedent because there's not the extra crab season. You can't go fishing for cod. You know what I mean? There's there's a whole lot of extras missing. I feel like right now. So. What's up, showman? How's it going? Sorry you're late. Nah, no need to apologize, man. No need to apologize at all. I mean, we will be done in a few minutes, but there's no need to apologize whatsoever. What's up, Adam? How's it going? Oh, crap. Uh... Just cancel that cut. Let's go to this side. There we go. What's with the tree? Ah, uh, they dance around a bit. Uh, I'm sure to get I'm sure to get more optimized as the game gets built. Perfect. Uh, yeah, I think that'll do that. Let's see how much energy we have. We have just enough to carry some of these, but I think I like the drive down them uh, and pick them up thing a little bit better. one tree at a time and just drive down pick them up you're good to go build my side walls again Uh, that did not work. This log is not happy about this situation, apparently. I think it's because the trailer's on such a hill. That is not what I'm meant to do. I think that's the problem. Let me, uh, let me pull up some. And just see if that fixes it. I think it's just because of the hill. That's exactly what it was. Still pick up some more. Maybe let the viewers choose what they want to see next time. The problem with that, Karina, I feel like we're going to get a lot of games that I don't even play. You know what I mean? I feel like that's going to be most of, most of the suggestion. Or it's going to be the same game every day. You know what I mean? And that I'm not going to do. Uh, but we can try that. Um, we can do a community vote uh, on the schedule. We could try that. We could try a community vote on the schedule for the next week. Like, which which game would you prefer to see over another? You know, that might work. I just I feel like we're gonna have a lot of you know people going you know more of this, more of that, and it's gonna be the same game. So it'll still kind of like I don't know. I don't know. I might have to figure out how to do the scheduling. Um, which game I would like to stream? And um, which games are 
rotated out as well. You know what I mean? Like I'll have to figure out how to how to do the vote that way. No repeats, only games you're already playing, but not often. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I mean, it, it'll be it'll be weird. It'll be good. I, I think that'll be a good idea, honestly. Skip the crucial harvesting time on FSN. Um, okay, from now on, my channel is nothing but farm sim. I won't be doing anything else. YouTube, Twitch, both. I'll just be playing farm sim from now on. I mean, again, this is what I was talking about right here, right? Like, that that's the stuff that's going to happen. If somebody's going to go, well, you shouldn't play this game, you know? Well, that's what I want to play, and I'm always going to play what I want to play. So. I'm not, you, you got you to gotta remember, I'm not going to not play games. I'm only asking what rotation of the games that we're going to be doing. So. I'm not going to stop playing something. That's not going to happen. Now, I mean, if I stop playing, it's because I wanted to. But, I mean, like, Subsistence by far is my lowest viewed game across all platforms. But I enjoy it. And I get to play with the community guys that want to play it. So, I'm not going to not do it just because it's the lowest viewed game. Okay, the vote's out of the question. Vote's completely out of the question. <laughs> We're not doing a vote. Not happening. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Cloyd. Exactly. Bone's already starting it. We're done. No, no voting. <laughs> no votes. <laughs> yeah, for one million subs. When I hit one million subs, I'll do. I'll do Fortnite. I'll do an entire week of Fortnite streams. Matter of fact, I'll do an entire month of Fortnite streams if we hit a million subscribers. What's Felix saying? What's up, man, by the way? How are you, Felix? Uh, I prefer to see dudes doing the snow runner without the language filter. Just once I can find out how he really feels. I mean, to be fair. There are games that make me way more upset, and Fortnite would be one of them. <laughs> I know, Adam, that's the joke, is nobody would. <laughs> nobody would watch me play Fortnite. That's that's the joke, though. Like, it's like, that's why that's why it's funny. I'm not going to hit a million subscribers anytime soon. So. Callo, how's it going? Hope you're doing well. One night, one stream after that I'm out. So you'd watch it once, Bob, just just to support the channel? <laughs> just to support the channel? Yeah. The original Fortnite? I could do that. That might be a fun that might be a fun community thing if anybody else has it. Uh, mainly because Fortnite saved the world as they're calling it now, which it used to just be Fortnite. Uh, until they broke Fortnite by adding stupid Battle Royale to it. Um, that would be actually kind of fun, because that game mode was a lot of fun. I give it that. That that game mode was a lot of fun. It's a whole different deal than the Battle Royale. Like, it's a whole different deal. Like, I feel like I could actually enjoy that, playing with the community, doing it once, and... Um, I mean, I feel like we'd have to do community games, right? We'd have to do something like Marvels on stream. Um, I mean, even for like 10,000 subscribers, right? I mean, a million's like, it's it's joking. It's a jokingly high number because it's just so, it's so abstract and so far off that it's just not feasible uh, for me. But um, the, the 10,000 mark, right, would be a lot of fun. I think doing just a full day of, of, Marbles on stream, playing with the community type stuff. You know what I mean? Like any kind of community type game, I think would be a lot of fun. 
uh, just hang out, play it, enjoy it, and, and celebrate the community. Not not necessarily because I hit 10,000 subscribers, but because we did. Because it is a community thing, right? I mean, it wouldn't be here without without you guys being the community. So uh, I think that might be a lot of fun doing something of that nature. Oh God. That is a hole and a half right there. Just trying to get turned around here. There we go. <laughs> Good gracious. Yeah, it's a fun multiplayer game for sure. Uh, the save the world part. Finally got uh, 46 44s and 44 40s. What is that? Is this thing gonna fall outside? I'm gonna fall on that car. Perfectly timed. I'm trying to push this back into my, my zone here. Well, I mean, I've always played what I want, what I want. I just, I've got so many games right now that it's near impossible for me to keep up when I'm cutting a day out. You know what I mean? That's, that's the biggest issue. And, and I need the extra time, um, in the mornings to be recording videos and stuff. This week I've been doing a lot of back end work and trying to figure out how I'm going to do it. Uh, starting next week, I'm going to be recording videos as well to put on YouTube. I've just got so many things going on that. I'm not I'm not able to keep up with them with my current schedule so I have to reschedule everything uh, which doesn't I mean it doesn't put any more pressure on me really uh, it's not a guarantee those videos will be out I'll only put them on the schedule if I know I'm gonna have time to record them you know what I mean like it's not gonna be one of those things that every day you can expect these games I, I can't commit to that schedule so um, it'll it'll only be if uh, I know I'm gonna get the game recorded or if I already have it recorded so it will only put it, be put on the schedule that way. But at the same time, I think it, I think it would be beneficial for me to do more games uh, consistently. Because a lot of them I am leaving out for two or three weeks at a time, you know? That's a pretty big deal. Two or three weeks is a long time not, not to have a game up. So... Um... I think I think the more consistent I can be with them, the better they'll do, and the more people enjoy them. Really, and that's the that's the main thing. But yeah, two or three weeks is a very long time to to skip a video. So I'm trying to get out of that. That's that's the that's the that's the point here. Is I'm trying to I'm trying to work everything back in the way I want it to. Get this trailer back up on this hill here. Why's it turning that way? Stop turning. Like I'm turning the real wheel the correct way, but the trailer's just not working. Jeez. Oh, this is this is working out perfectly. Yeah, let's just drop this log somewhere then. Not on the ground. Oh, this is a really difficult place to pick logs up. Okay. Uh there. There we go. Gracious. That was tough. Got to get one more on here. Can't get to it there. Oh, there it is. Got it. Sweet. So definitely making some dents in uh, in some areas now. That's good. Oh, the John the John Deere's. Yeah, man. Yeah, the forty series. <laughs> you would call them the, the tractors you rode with on da uh, with Dad across thousands of acres. Yeah, man. Heck yeah. The 40 series. Heck yeah. Need more power. Yes, absolutely need more power. What happens if you cut it and it falls out of your property line? I don't know. I'm not willing to find out. <laughs> if you don't know what Desert Bus is, it's a real-time uh, bus driving sim going from Tucson to Vegas and back. The bus has a slight pull to the right. Weird. I didn't know that. Can you repair the truck or buy another? Like paint, make it look better. Not not as far as I know, not yet. Um, 
I know in Farmer's Dynasty, though, we did get the option eventually to uh, uh, to repair and paint and all that kind of stuff, uh, Gallo. So I'm hoping they bring it to Lumberjack's Dynasty as well. I'm sure they will. Um, I don't think it's in-game yet, though. I'm pretty sure it's not. If it is, I've just not done it yet, so... Four tractors. There's a couple of uh, older four tractors. I really want to go uh, down the road here one day and just look at some of the old equipment. There's some of those, uh, the old school balers, like the one you start out with in Farmer's Dynasty. There's one of those sitting down the road. Uh, there's an old Ford tractor sitting just up the road from me. Uh, I really want to check out some of this old farm equipment sitting around, just take pictures of it and stuff. Of course, I want to get permission from the people that own it. So, um, yeah. It's like guys are getting the heist together. We see you trying to sneak in. You're not fooling anybody. <laughs> yep, Gabriel caught it too, see? Told you. <laughs> Gabriel saw it. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to sneak in here. We see you. We see you. And they're trying to lowball people at heist number. I'm telling you. But yeah, the, the voting for, the voting for rotation might be a good idea. Honestly, I was just I, I know you can't tell, um, but my, my sarcasm is really bad. Uh, but um, I was joking about not doing the voting for the rotation. Uh, it's probably a good idea. Of course, we're gonna have the staples: Farmers Dynasty, Lumberjacks Dynasty, right? Uh, and I brought Farm Sim Friday back. So uh, between Wednesday Thursday, we would vote on rotation, and then if I'm able to record, I can record games that are not voted in and still put the content out. So uh, I think that might be a good option. Um, until until August, I don't have any shows or anything. I don't think I might have some small stuff. Uh, but at the moment, I doubt it. I doubt I have anything from now to August, especially with the second wave of this COVID thing going on. Uh, the last thing an artist is going to do is get up and sing in a microphone that somebody else just sang into. We would have to we'd have to switch out mics um, after every band, and it's just not feasible. So, and honestly, I don't know how many artists would actually get on stage and play right now. So, uh, with a crowd of folks and and using, you know, like whatever I, I just don't i don't see it happening in the next three weeks to a month so for for the foreseeable month or so uh, i think we're good on uh that kind of stuff i should be able to put more content out without uh too much uh too much extra effort so um i've just got to get i've got to keep myself motivated that's the hardest part for me is staying motivated Singing in mask is hard, yes. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> uh. Can somebody quickly explain what this game is about? This game is... Um, so basically, when you start out the game, you uh, your uncle owns a lumber mill, uh, and is, he wants to retire, so you're, you're taking it over, but you need to make enough money to buy it from him kind of thing. So, uh, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much what the game entails. Uh, so then you gotta make enough money. You gotta catch logs in midair. 
I thought we got it that time. You get it? Maybe we moved it enough. Yeah, I think we moved it enough that time. Um, so yeah, that's basically what it, what the basis of the game is, but there's so much more than that. Uh, if you look here, uh, I may be too low of food. Yeah, so you have to eat and sleep and everything, but uh, let's see if that got it. Yeah, that got it. All right, cool. So, uh, no, it didn't either. Oh, it's because it's raining. It's raining, so there's no side quest today. Uh, but there's there's many, many, many things you can do in my game. My thing's scrolling again. Uh, there's many, many things to do. So it's not just one or the other. Uh, I feel too tired to care. Is there is there somewhere I can go to relax close by? Probably not. Go down there. Um, I may just cut these and trim them. I may just, yeah, I may just do that. We'll, we'll cut these up and uh, we'll drop them here. And at some point we'll carry them and drop them in one place. So yeah, I mean that's the basis of the game, but you can you can do all these things from you have a greenhouse, small little greenhouse uh, on your home area. You've got apple trees. You can do beehives, uh, pick mushrooms, find herbs, make herbal potions. Similar to Farmer's Dynasty, it's, it's pretty, yeah, it's the same same thing. Yeah, it's very similar. It's very similar to Farmer's Dynasty. It's, a, it's the same build, right? It's the same uh, graphics engine and everything, I think. Medieval's Dynasty is going to be a different graphics engine, but this one is the same as far as I know. That tree just straight, oh, it's behind me now. That works. Yeah, it's the exact same thing, basically, as, as Farmer's Dynasty. I'm hoping whatever, whichever piece of this law, this tree is causing it to lag through, we can cut pretty quick there. But yeah, it's the same, it's the exact same as Farmer's Dynasty for the most part. Um, it's just Lumberjack instead. And there, there are new mechanics to the game. So you see here, you can level up and all that kind of stuff. Um, so there's new stuff. Uh, there's herbs. Uh, so you can make herbal potions, shampoos, stuff like that now. Uh, of course, you have different things. So I've got wood planks. Uh, that I can create myself to rebuild things with now. So again, there's there's new There's new new elements in the game And I think what they did is they took farmers dynasty built off of it took took the community's um, Input and stuff and then built it into this so I, th I think they did a fantastic job with it honestly Tim oh, that's a big boy. That's Nice. I had to just watch that fall, so. It's your birthday present, Bob. There you go, Brian. <laughs> What's up, David? How's it going? Uh, but yeah, I mean, it's it's pretty much the same as Farmer's Dynasty. There's just, there's more elements coming to this than there will be to Farmer's Dynasty, as far as I can see, anyway. Uh, I don't know if they're going to retro and go put stuff back in Farmer's Dynasty or not, but... I'm going to cut this here and just see if we can... Oh, that piece disappeared. Okay, what about this one? If we can push this back around. Okay, maybe it'll still be there. Maybe it'll still be there when we get ready to pick it up. Can't always make it to watch it live. Yeah, that's no problem. That's 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 one reason I like YouTube is because the videos are there after the fact. On Twitch, they're only there for like 45 days or 60 days, and then they're gone. So uh, I do like the fact that uh, at least on YouTube, it's like uploading a video. I just get to hang out with you guys and do it live. That's the biggest part for me. That's what makes this the most fun, to be quite honest. It's because I get to hang out with you guys, but it's still a video. It still stays. It counts, you know, for later. So... All right, last tree for the day. Uh, I wanted to go ahead and get some of these cut up and stuff, and we're going to go grab uh, some more pallets. We should have enough to make one more run to the lumber store, so we're going to go do that. We'll, we'll, we started the video with selling pallets, and we'll end the video with delivering pallets, uh, just so the title and thumbnail make sense. 
<laughs> that's, that's pretty much the, the only reason I'm doing this last load is so that everybody goes, we didn't deliver any more pallets. You said pallet delivery day. Don't be mad at me, guys. I've got to cut logs to make pallets. Felix, your birthday is the 29th. Nice. Mine, mine and Miss uh, Deuce's five-year anniversary is coming up as well. The 24th of this month. We've been together five years, the 24th of this month. Crazy, man. It seems like yesterday, honestly. Let me go ahead and save. Uh, save there. Let's save there this time. Yeah. Let's do that. Uh, first lumberjack to die from a falling tree must have been a great guy. They tell his name every time they cut a tree. Tim Burr. <laughs> oh, that's funny. And I've got a truck over here somewhere. I'm sure we have enough pallets to haul at least one load, so. Yeah, there's eight waiting creates, so that's good. We got at least uh, one full load with the uh, addition of uh, hanging one off the thing here, if we can still do that. I can figure out how to use this thing again. Looking at it like this is weird, because it's like... There we go. The arm, the arm is going a different direction than what I think it should be going. <laughs> it's so strange. It's supposed to be yelled. Yeah. Yeah, it's him for like yelling. All right, off we go to the store. This still works, right? I can still do this. Yeah, it looks like it works fine. Turn the old headlights on. It is it is dark in game here compared to what it normally is. Yours is the 21st, Brian's is the 27th, Felix is the 20 what? Uh, the 29th. So we got a lot of birthdays this month. Gabriel, you stopped having birthdays 10 years ago? 29 forever. Hey, I don't blame you, man. Oh God, Bone. <laughs> I haven't heard a Tinder joke in forever. <laughs> right, Felix? <laughs> oh man. Alright, here we are. Sell market. 1,820. Uh, so we, this is the first time I think I've started out the day with, uh, or finished the game with more money than I've started with, uh, since we started Lumberjack's Dynasty. So that's a good thing, guys. It's a good thing. Well, I say that. This is the first day we've bought a new piece of property and, and ended with more money. And we just bought a truck, too. We're doing good. We're making progress. Making progress. Uh, while I drive back, I'm gonna do my spiel for the day, of course. Uh, go follow me on all the social medias. Um, go follow on Twitch. I'll be streaming there tonight, playing some subsistence if you want to come hang out for that. Uh, you can find everything at deucemess.tv. So if you just want to go to one place and find everything, you can head over to deucemess.tv and find all things outhouse related there. All my social media links are there. All the, all the information you need to find will be there. Uh, you can find the Discord link there as well, I do believe. Um... I appreciate you guys for being here and hanging out so very much. Thank you guys for all the laughs today. It's been a fun day. Uh, you gave me some ideas on rescheduling and such. So, big thanks for that. 
Um, we will be doing a vote at some point um, on uh, what games to rotate in and out each week. Uh, as per the community's request, a um, couple of things about that. They will all be games that I'm already playing. I will not be playing new games. Uh, GTA 5 definitely, definitely is not in my rotation of games. So don't ask. Um, Fortnite, not in my rotation of games. Don't ask. <laughs> just so everybody is aware don't bother we will not be doing any of that um but uh any kind of simulation game that i'm already playing if you want to see more of it we'll rotate it in and out as you see fit um what's on the agenda for tonight tonight we are doing subsistence multiplayer Red Dead 2. Uh, I've thought about Red Dead 2. It's just, it would take up so much hey, time, man. Welcome to the outhouse. It would take up so much time. Bearded Lord, thank you for subscribing. Welcome, welcome. You want to see Fortnite in GTA 5? It's not happening. It's just not going to happen, man. I'm not an RP guy, and the only way to play GTA 5 and make it entertaining is be an RP guy. And I'm not an RP guy. I'm not a role play guy. I'm just not. Um... Your completion is killing you. Yeah, Red Dead killed me, man. I, I tried for every achievement in Red Dead. It was awesome. Uh, I just it takes so much time up, man. I don't know that I could. Um, I really don't know uh, if I could do Red Dead too. I would literally have to stream. I'd flip my streams and stream on Twitch during the day, and stream for six, seven hours a day playing Red Dead. I think to to get anywhere on it. So. You spend hours hunting just complete things. Exactly, Gabriel. And that's my point. I just don't know that I would have time to play a game that big. Uh, that's the one reason I haven't streamed any Borderlands 3 yet. I'm a huge fan of Borderlands. I've been playing Borderlands since day one. I love Borderlands. But I haven't even played it because there's so much going on that I can't even play it. Like, unless I'm streaming it. And even then, streaming Borderlands for two or three hours isn't enough. Like, you don't get anywhere. So, uh, but either way, that's going to do it for me today, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you for hanging out. Thank you for the new subscribers. Appreciate you guys. If you haven't hit the like button yet, please do so on your way out. It would help me out a ton um, for you watching this later. Um, if you want to, head over to Twitch and, and follow there. You can find the links down below in the description. Find all the links for everything down in, in, in the description below. Um, I think that's about it. Uh, be sure to hit the like button. And if you just started watching this vi video, we'll be back up uh, in about three hours time. And you can come back and watch it if you cho so choose to. If you missed the beginning of it and you want to see the beginning. More than welcome to do that. I'll see you guys tonight over on Twitch. Have a good afternoon, everybody. Good morning, good night, wherever you are. See you then. Happy birthday, Bob. Later, guys.